when a man from the Surma tribe in Ethiopia is looking for a wife, he doesn't look for the common things that you look for in a modern woman. Things like beauty, brain and class. He looks for something really different. Something out of this world that you wouldn't imagine. And that is the woman with the biggest leaflet. Something that me and you would find extremely odd and uncomfortable. But behold, this here is the real definition of beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder. <laughs> and when it comes to the women of the Sulma tribe, wearing a lip plate is a symbol of great beauty that takes them to extreme lengths just to get one. Because getting a lip plate this big is an extremely painful process as you can imagine. <laughs> but to them it doesn't matter because it makes them beautiful in the eyes of their men to get one of these plates a girl must be 15 years old and above where her mother first removes her incisors and then cuts her lower lip at the center the cut is then held open by a wooden plug until it heals slowly <laughs> As it heals, the girl is supposed to be changing the plug with larger ones for it to stretch so it can comfortably hold the plates which are made from clay soil. It's up to the girls how far they want the lip to be stretched and after several months, it will be healed. <laughs> now, when the healing is done, the girl's family cannot start accepting suitors, and the bigger the leaflet, the larger the dowry. For small ones, 40 cows will be given as dowry, but for big ones, it's 60 plus cows. The larger the plate, the more beautiful the woman is. <laughs> For the young men, it's not just about cows alone they'll have to give. They'll have to prove themselves to be warriors in order to draw attention of the girls. And this is through the dog stick fighting. The dog stick fighting is a very dangerous game with lots of violent deaths that sometimes the Soma women have trouble finding a husband due to the high rate of deaths caused by the game. Now get this, the Soma tribe is the most dangerous tribe in the whole of Africa because they walk around with guns like sticks. Although the donga is an extremely violent and dangerous sport, it's also a rite of passage that every boy must go through to be considered a man and this is also how he attracts the girl of his dreams. Just like the women of the Surma tribe go through a lot of pain to get the lip plates, the men also subject their bodies to rough and painful tests to prove themselves to their women. During the doga, the fighter expects and awaits the wound that will bond his flesh with the mark of a courageous warrior. The skin bursts on impact and bones break. Sometimes an internal organ is injured and death follows after one or two days of agony. But the fighters don't worry about this as long as they get to have the mark of a warrior. During the tough duel, the man gets the chance to show off his best moves to the girls. And after the duel is done and the suitor is found, it's time for the bride price, which again will depend on the size of the leaflet. Each man owns his breed of cows, and the number of cows indicate a man's wealth. So if the man is rich enough and has over 60 cows, 
well, he'll get the most beautiful bride with the biggest leaflet. After the bread price has been agreed on, the wedding is quite simple. That's it for today. Thanks for watching.